Hello YouTube. I was in a thrift store the other day and I found these humanitarian humanitarian daily rations. And I was very curious as to what's inside. So let's check it out together. It's clearly an MRE, but it's not an MRE meant for a soldier. It's meant for people the army is housing. Yeah, let's see what they've got. This is menu number two. And I've already opened it, but that's because we had a little camera problem, but I just opened it. Let's see what's inside. It comes in this big pack. There's nothing else inside this. They're all in the secondary pack. And the first thing we've got here is veggie, a vegetarian barley stew. Then, ha, ah, now this looks like a pop tart. Frosted toasted pastry with brown sugar. That's going to be delicious. I can just feel it. This is an oatmeal cookie. And my wife's already saying she wants to try that. Peanut butter. Ooh, strawberry jam. Making me think there's going to be some crackers or something in here. The nutritional packet for peas and tomato sauce, which must be in here. Can you read that? Oh, a nice little condiment package and some wet wipes and a spoon. Let's see what all's in there. Let's clear you a spot so you can see. In this pack, we've got a nice sturdy spoon. Not as sturdy as the old MREs, but pretty sturdy. Two big packs of sugar, a pack of salt, pepper. Crushed red pepper. Ooh, a little pack of matches. Check that out. A pack of matches. A wet wipe. And a regular napkin. Okay. No, this must be a cracker. A shortbread cookie. Oh, let's see how good their shortbread is. These are the traditional crackers that I'm familiar with in an MRE. They are pretty good too. And this must be my peas in tomato sauce. That doesn't sound amazing, but check it out. You know what is clearly missing from this is a heater. They don't have a heater for these things. But we'll heat it up in the microwave and we'll give it a taste. Here is the vegetable barley stew nutrition page. Okay. Why matches white in the head? Ah, good question. Will they change it? Are they going to be a different color? Are they easier to biodegrade or something? I don't think so. I think they're just white. Okay. Here. What shall we open first, girls? Um, Cookie? Can you grab me a plate to throw this on? Oh, that's wonderful. Wait, Let's get this out of the way. The beef and barley stew so we can uh, yes, it's not beef and barley, it's just... It's just veggie oh. barley, but yeah, grab me a bowl and we'll throw it on there. Okay. You have a good look at that bowl? Yeah. Interesting. Oh, it opens like this. So it's got perforations here at the top. So you can open it all the way, just like this. You could eat it out of that. Yeah, exactly. And it's yeah. a pouch that you can eat out of. Whoops. I think it's also good for, like, if children have to do this. Oh, let's get a look there. Aaron's not impressed with the look. Let's taste it. Unheated. Oh, I like that. Hmm, give this a taste. Hmm, that's really good, actually. That might be one of the better things that uh, MREs have packaged in the past. That tastes like beefaroni ravioli. Yes, it does. I mean, like beefaroni. Hold on, you want to give it a minute in the microwave? 
And hand me another bowl and I will open this other entree. Now I wonder, is this meant to be your whole days? It almost must be. There's 300 calories in this shortbread cookie. There is 210 calories in this. Oh, so it is. It absolutely is a daily ration. This is meant to be your entire day's meal. And yeah, certainly a pretty good that. day's meal. Yeah. This is peas in tomato sauce. And I'm guessing not green peas. This must be chickpeas. I mean, they're feeling pretty solid in here. So just like the last one, it opens so you can eat it like a pouch. Oh, black-eyed peas. Black-eyed peas and a tomato sauce. Let's give it a taste. Unheated. It's kind of like a, like a stew kind of on. Oh, it's good. Mmm. Mm-hmm. That's a really good entree. The other thing this thing is missing is the little thing of Tabasco. Oh, wow. If it had some Tabasco sauce in it, mm -hmm. that'd be really good. Okay. Oh. Well, that's really, look at that. You need to get a good look there. That's quality, huh? These are uh, kind of better than the old MREs I'm used to. Oops. Hmm, a little mess up. Okay. Now let's oh shortbread cookie. So there are two cookies in here. There's an oatmeal cookie, a shortbread cookie, a pastry, yeah, a pop tart, and crackers. I think this that's is for uh, like to be fair, you're not having a good day when you have to have one of these. No, you are not. <laughs> so giving some kids or some people a little treat is at least nice. Oatmeal cookie? Oh, shortbread cookie, isn't it? Sorry, shortbread cookie. I got my cookies mixed up. Look at the little... It's falling apart on me. Look at that shortbread cookie. What's that about? Three and a half inches across? Mm-hmm. That's a good cookie. Let's taste it. Oh, that's not any good. Y'all don't want to try that. That's delicious. That's that's just a good shortbread cookie. Okay. Now the oatmeal cookie. Mm. We're gonna get in here, I promise. The oatmeal cookie. Oh, also very good looking cookie. That's a really good cookie too. Try the shortbread first. This looks like they could be like a little bake sale. Shortbread cookie? Yeah, sure. This does. It looks like they could be at a little bake sale, doesn't it? Mm. That's a good shortbread cookie. That is a good shortbread cookie. Okay. Pop tart. This is probably just a good old fashioned pop tart. Probably the same kind of pop tart you would buy at any grocery store. Might be the off-brand. Oh no, it's just pop tart. Look, it's a pop tart. Oh. It's an actual pop tart, y'all. Vacuum sealed. What can I get my pop tarts vacuum sealed? Oh, interesting. Huh. has a strange consistency to it. It is not a completely normal Pop-Tart. They probably removed certain ingredients to keep it fresher for longer. Oh, there are two Pop-Tarts here. Mm -hmm. They have uh, kind of melded together a bit. But you can see there, there are two Pop-Tarts here actually. Very good, try that out. Get you some uh, brown sugar there. Mm. Well, that's a delicious pop tart. Oh, kind of reminds me of a uh, Snickerdoodle. Mm -hmm. Here's the crackers. Now, these are the same crackers they've been putting in MREs for 10 years or so. But I like them. They're really good crackers. They're always shelf stable. And of course, they give you some peanut butter and some strawberry jam to go on it. 
This is quite the meal for the day. This is also good because I think if you really needed to, you could... Strawberry um, jam there. You could store some of this. Ooh. Or share it if mm -hmm. you had to. Very good strawberry jam. Little peanut butter. Peanut butter has always been a solid. Uh, oops. This is you, not so you, much. You should have um, needed the. Oh, yeah. Emulsified it a bit. We're making a mess here, y'all. Okay, we'll try this again. There we go. Just as I said, peanut butter has always been a solid part of an MRE. Mm -hmm. I'll start making a mess with it. <laughs> Look at this. Very good, as, as you would expect peanut butter to be. Here, you better try. Um. There's also no vegetable component. I'm um, not vegetable. Beverage component. What do you do oh, with Oh, there's no beverage component. What do you do with That's the sugar? true. A regular MRE has coffee, a drink. Maybe water is shipped in differently. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's see how this is heated up. I think it's going to be unbelievably delicious. I'm going to stir. Wow. I usually don't love meals that exclude meat. And these are delicious. Mm -hmm. I like this barley one a little better though. This barley stew, I mean it's very thick. This is wonderful. I'm gonna have to read up though on the lack of some of the components like coffee and drink i guess they're providing those in a separate way it could be but the question then would be why why did you put sugar two two containers of sugar yeah why's the sugar in here if there's not a beverage hmm. like sugar tea can or... be good for if your kid or someone around you has like a medical emergency a little mm -hmm. fresh nap here to clean off which i clearly need Pippin says there's peanut butter and she can smell it. Oh yeah, that's nice. After you finished your meal. What else is in here? Crushed red pepper. I was supposed to put the crushed red pepper on something. Well, this was wonderful. That is pretty interesting. I'm gonna have to learn a little bit more about these humanitarian meals. Thanks for watching. See you later.